A slightly inebriated, or maybe more than slightly inebriated, overserved gentleman came up to him after a performance one night and kind of wobbled back and forth and said, I just want you to know you have played yourself beyond recognition here tonight. <laughs> and so it is with a scurry of squirrel. Great job, Kelly. <laughs> this group of pickers actually met at a Friday night poker game. But what started as friendly competition turned into a wild night. Resulted in raised voices, hurt feelings, and Tom's broken leg. It'll become ever apparent in just a moment. They figured they'd better try a new pastime before someone lost a limb in this whole thing. And in all fairness to Tom, they decided to do something that wouldn't require two legs. Bluegrass. Put your hands together for band number two. <laughs> Whoever thought that was a good idea? All right, we don't have one of those cute little kids. This is what we have. This is what we have tonight. Isn't he adorable? Yeah. Oh, well, hey, welcome. Glad to have you here tonight. And uh, we're band number two. Hey, what's the name of your band? I can't, I can't tell you. What's the name of your band? All right, folks, here's our band. What's the word? I can't tell you. <laughs> Enjoy our music. <laughs>
faster than I thought. What do you call two banjo players? Uh, I forgot the joke. Come on, guys. Hold on. This really is bringing down the house, I know. You just made it up, right? I did. <laughs> How do you synchronize two banjo players? You shoot the one. Sorry, Gene. <laughs> yeah, Gene. I hope you enjoy. <laughs>